You know, droughts create a lot of, of production challenges and, and physical management challenges for producers as, as, they, uh, as they enter into a drought and during a drought. But I think the market implications of a drought really start sooner than that. And, and the real challenge for most producers, if they see conditions developing that could turn into a drought, is, is always to be kind of one step ahead. You really need to make your planning ahead of time in terms of market and financial implications before, well before you're into a drought because, you know, in addition to all of the hardships and, and management challenges that go on during a drought, many times if the drought is, is very significant over a wide region, then it will be big enough to have market impacts as well. And so producers not only incur a lot of additional costs to deal with, with the drought, but if they're ultimately forced to sell animals in a drought, they often do so in, in depressed markets because of that. And so the sooner you can anticipate that drought conditions are developing and, and begin making the combination of production and marketing changes that you need to going into a drought, the more flexibility you have to try to preserve the value or the equity you have in, in your operation. And so you wanna, you wanna plan financially for a drought before you get into it and, and do some market planning. By the same token, once you're in a drought, you've made some of those early changes, but depending on the severity and depending on indications of when the drought might be coming to an end, you wanna plan for recovery well before you get into recovery in terms of a strategy for rebuilding the operation. Obviously, again, it, it's tied very closely to the physical resources of an operation in terms of what's the condition of those resources coming out of a drought. But, uh, but also what are the market conditions? And, and sometimes in some droughts, we have very unique circumstances where planning ahead on the timing and the process of recovery, whether to try to be ahead of other people or whether to be a little bit more patient, uh, all of those things need planning. So you always really wanna be operating on the market standpoint, sort of one step ahead of where you really are with respect to a drought. Well, you know, there's really no typical thing that you can count on for sure, but if anything, you would expect in the middle of a drought that because there's a lot of people doing the same thing at the same time, you might see uh, market impacts, uh, depressed prices in the middle of a, of a drought. And so a producer's challenge is, is uh, again, from the standpoint of managing their operation physically and, and managing the production aspects of the operation, is also to, to anticipate that and try to be one step ahead of that going into it. It doesn't always happen. In the drought of 2011, for example, even though it was a very devastating drought and it caused drought and it caused significant liquidation of animals, the, uh, the broader cattle market situation at that time was such that we didn't see the kind of market price impacts that I would have normally expected in a drought of that magnitude. So we were sort of lucky in that case that we didn't see the, uh, the market impacts on top of the drought impacts. Uh, but in general, one would want to assume that you're going to see prices getting lower going into a drought. So if you're going to be forced to sell, selling sooner rather than later is generally what you're looking at. And by the same token, coming out of a drought, you may well see a market reaction the other way. Prices are going to go up. And so this, you know, if you can get yourself in a position uh, physically and, and in terms of your resources to be prepared to move ahead of that and anticipate the market situation before you get into a drought and anticipate the end of the market or the end of the drought while you're still in the middle of the drought and, and make those plans. <music>